I'm Debbie Hammer Davis and welcome back to the back of my car when we've been recording a series of videos to show you how to fit the ever popular car seats both with and without Isofix. Um, there is a video on our channel that shows you how to find your Isofix. If you need to find that, obviously just have a look at that separate video. If you do want to install it with a seatbelt, this is the ever popular Maxi Cozy Cabrio. Um, so if you have got one of these and you want to fit it with the seatbelt, this is how to do it safely and securely. So pop it in the back of the seat, uh, back of the car. If you do have leather seats like me, it is always a good idea to put a mat underneath it because it does help to stop the slippage and it will obviously protect your seats. But when we're trying to do the videos, we found it's clearer for you if we don't pop the mat in. So when you're popping your cabrio in the car, it's important that your handle is in the upright position. This is because in the event of an accident, it does help protect your child. So it's important that you don't put your handle down. You can put your hood down if you want to be able to see your baby um, easier. And we do recommend installation of a mirror so that you can see your baby uh, when you're driving. So first of all, we're going to take our seat belts and we're going to thread it through underneath these two guides. And these guides are always blue. Uh, people do question it and say to me, can I not have a blue one? But the regulations for this particular car seat say that all of the guides must be blue. So uh, that's why, just in case, because lots of people ask that question. So just thread your seatbelt. It must be tucked through here securely. And then what we're going to do is plug it into our clunk click uh, seatbelt. Um, I've only got very short arms, so I'm having to reach over. But you do want to get that nice and securely. Now, this is the little key to getting this securely in the car. When you get to this point, pull it nice and securely and tightly because what you're trying to do is take the slack out. Hopefully you can see that. I'm gonna do it again because if you have a floppy belt like this, your car seat's never going to sit securely in the car. So you're going to pull it really tight and just pop down on it like that. Give it a good pull. You're not going to damage the seat belt. And then we're going to come around the back of the seat and thread it through the other catch, also blue, on the back of the seat like this. Now when you've got it in the car, make sure it's nice and uh, level and then just give it another pull just make sure there's no extra slack and once you've installed that it should be very secure you can see that that's not moving and it is very secure in the car so that is how to install the uh, best-selling cabrio maxi cozy car seat in the back of your car without an isofix point i hope that you found this video helpful if you are watching on our youtube channel we'd love it if you gave us a thumbs up and if you want to leave us a comment, we always really appreciate it. If you do want to watch the other videos and subscribe to our page, do click the bell icon at the top and we'll send you all of the other videos as we record them. Thanks once again for joining us today.